who you know is more important than what you know. That's one reason why some engage in politics to secure lucrative contracts. It's time to know the most important person in the universe, the Holy Ghost. Whatever God has for you, your marriage, healing, salvation, finances will be channeled through him. In this best-selling book, Kakwa Baden will teach you practically how to develop your relationship with the Holy Ghost. You can order this book through the following means. Place your order on Facebook by posting Order Holy Ghost in the comment section or message window. This book is also available as an e-book on Amazon, Kindle or Kobo.com. We also deliver worldwide. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Catch the Anointing Center, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome. Kakra has been sharing a powerful message titled, How to Thank God in Difficult Times, based on the story of the raising of Lazarus from the dead in John chapter 11. Today, he talks about prayer. Let's join in. Point number three. You know, in this story, it was the giving of Martha and Mary that provoked the miracle-working power of Jesus and his prayer. Prayer helps. Prayer helps because prayer can release the miracle-working power of God. That's what it does. It can change the situation. It doesn't minimize the pain. It changes the situation. And in this world, there are all kinds of strange problems. Yesterday, somebody called me and told me a strange story. It said the mother went to a restaurant, ordered some food, was eating, and saw another man on another table eating. But that man who was eating is a dead man that the mother used to know. He was in the restaurant, also eating, the dead man. And she said, the mother looked at the dead man and could not believe that this man who is dead is actually in the restaurant. And the dead man was looking at the mother and was smile. <laughs> <laughs> if you have a problem like that and you are discouraged, <laughs> then he said, the mother bowed her head to take something from her plate. When she lifted up her eyes, the dead man was walking away. So she couldn't believe her eyes. So she called the people that, he said, the people who were in the restaurant, who is, did they see the man who was? They said, oh, they all saw the man. The man just got up and left. So they all at least attested to the fact that the man was sitting there. Then, they asked, did the man order anything? He said, no, the man didn't order anything. She was just looking at her and she would just smile. <laughs> <laughs> the dead man. Now, if you see someone like that in a restaurant, can you give thanks to God? <laughs> oh, your, your, your thanksgiving will vanish like fuel in sunlight. So this, this lady called me yesterday and told me this story. And I said, let's pray. You know, and I was thinking in my mind, these things, I've seen them before. I have come across dead people before. As to whether they were real dead, that's another story. As to who they were, it's another story. But I've seen it before. So we prayed. And after my prayer, you know what she said? Prophet, thank you. Prayer releases thanksgiving. Because it gives you that assurance that the power of God is moving. Prayer releases faith. And it's that faith that makes you start thanking God. That look, God will do it. I've not seen it yet, but he will do it. That faith makes some thanksgiving explode in your heart because you have prayed. 
260 something thousand people have died in America. The most advanced nation in the world. And you are alive. You must thank God. The greatest gift is the gift of life. That you are alive. There are many rich people who will trade your health. They will collect your unemployment and give you their sickness. If only we agree. So these people have been supporting Jesus, blessing him. And when Jesus prayed, mm, things happen. Prayer. Prayer is a good response. When it's difficult to thank the Lord, prayer is good. Thanks for joining us. Today we learned that to be able to thank God in difficult times, we must pray because it assures us of God's power and releases faith. Join us tomorrow for the continuation of this exciting message. Before we go, here's a praise report to boost your faith. My wife has delivered twins. Dear Prophet, I sent you an email concerning my wife who was due to deliver twins and was having issues. You replied that you had prayed for me and recommended the series Dominating by Faith. Prophet, my wife delivered safely and both mother and babies are in great health. God bless you. Thanks for your time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full-length message or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to plus 233 55 790 10. Send an email to info at .org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to plus 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you.